I don't know about you guys, but when I was beginning and still later in time, I'd, especially in open mics, I'd be, I'd be ready to go on stage and I'd sit there and think, why am I doing this to myself? But then I'd get up the next week and do it again, or the next day and do it again and do it again. They can't pay you enough money to go through what you need to go through to become a comedian. The ironic thing is you'll do it all for free. You go out there night after night after night with no sleep and work on the jokes. You'll do all that for free because you want to make people laugh. That's the difference between people who do it, people who don't do it. People go out and a lot of people go out there and go, this is hard. There's a lot to know. Yeah. It's one of the misnomers of stand up that it's easy. You don't need to know anything. Wow. Really? Uh, take one of my classes and you're going to sit around and go, wow, I had no idea that there's all these things I need to not just know, go out and get good at, not just know them. You could know what a riding a unicycle is. Does that mean you can ride one? No. The only way to learn how to ride one is get up and fall down hundreds of times until you figure out some place inside yourself and you find your equilibrium and then you're writing and then you're doing tricks and then you're doing well same thing with stand-up but you got to spend all that time falling down and getting hurt and getting mad and throwing things and screaming and yelling and then you get better and better and better and pretty soon one of these days somebody's going to go hey i'd like to give you some money for this <laughs> then you become a professional